Some very special people are in the Seven Club in motorsport. Michael Schumacher, Jimmy Johnson, if, if you can do it, I know you want to get it done first, what would that mean to you to be a seven-time champion in this sport? I hate talking about things that <laughs> haven't happened. Yeah. I'm, uh, I'm very grateful to have won one championship, let alone six. Um, I'm very grateful for the opportunities that, uh, that present themselves this weekend to be able to, to add to that six tally, you know. But it's no more or less than an opportunity. We've, we've worked hard to get the opportunity, but um, we'll continue to work hard and make sure we, we execute in the last weekend of, uh, of a, what's been a very tough 2017. Why has it been so tough for you and you're at the points lead at the perfect time? Yeah, in, in an ideal world in motorsport and uh, I'm a big believer of the, um, the team that, has, that, that goes the fastest um, generally, generally wins the championship. Um, at, a lot of the times this year we haven't been the quickest car so we've had to rely on good teamwork, um, just grinding it out, making sure that we do everything right um, and the result of that is, yeah, while we haven't been the quickest, we've given ourselves an opportunity to, to somewhat steal this one. So um, we'll continue with that. We have improved the, the car speed quite a lot the last few months, which, uh, which has given us, given us some hope. Um, but, we'll, you know, once again, if the other guys get it, get it right, then uh, they're going to be extremely hard to beat. We'll, um, we'll, we'll, we'll battle as hard as we can to so end up. What's the battle been like with the emerging force that is DJR Team Penske in this pit lane now? It's something that fans have savoured and enjoyed, but as someone who's battling them, what's that been like? Um, you know, they've really, they've really stepped up. You know, their, their performances this year are, are much greater than last year. Um, they've put a lot of pressure on us, but there's no more pressure than what we've put on ourselves. We, we, um, we expect absolutely everything and expect high expectations from ourselves so um, what DJ have brought to the table has been below that but it's certainly been certainly been a lot of pressure so um, you know, this weekend I'd love to just come in and, and enjoy it and cruise around but at the, but at the end of the day we've made a lot of sacrifice we've um, you know we've made sure that we we do everything we can to, to do our best performance and we'll see what happens on the weekend. Where is Shane Van Gisbergen in all of this? Because mathematically, he's a contender, albeit a, a long shot. He says he's focused on the team's championship. Can he help you in this bid, or is he just going to run his own race? Shane's a competitor, and he's here to win the first um, Newcastle 500, you know, and, which is, and so are all the other drivers. No doubt, you know, we, we, both, we both help each other out. We help each other out all year with, with cars set up, and. Um, if I can't win, I want Shane to win, and I'm sure it's the same with Shane. If he can't win, he, he wants uh, he wants me to win, mainly to keep the boss happy, to keep some keep some calmness within the group. Um, so no, nothing untoward. We'll go out there and race hard, and uh, if we can if we can work together in some way over the you know the next couple of days, then then we certainly will. We couldn't have this chat without talking about Bathurst. How do you feel about that, knowing where we're at now? Had it been different, it could have been very different coming into the Coats High 500, couldn't it? For, for both parties, yeah. for both parties, you know, at, at the end, we both had engine failures, but lucky enough for car 88, we were able to get back to the pits and still score 90 points. Are you just living in the now? Lots of people want to know what Jamie Wincup's long-term plans are in the in the sport. What what are they, and, and how do you feel about the future? Yeah, I've I've got to make some decisions soon about the about the future and what I'm what I'm going to do within within this awesome sport of. of uh, Supercars racing, um, but I've, I've put everything on hold until after the weekend. There's there's nothing more important than this year's championship. Uh, one eye on next year's car and on where I'm going to be driving, you know, in, in the in the in the future. But really, the only thing that matters right now is, is this weekend. And as I say, putting in our best performance, whatever whatever result that gives. I was there in 2014 when you got a standing ovation at the gala, mate, for six championship wins. We sincerely wish you all the very best this weekend. Thank you for chatting to thanks, us. Bro. Cheers. Cheers. Thanks, mate.